Hey you guys, this is Easy Breezy and you are tuned in to part two to my lace closure wig install. If you missed part one, I showed you guys how I made the closure really flat, how I defined the part and did my baby hair, and I also showed you guys how I cut my layers. Now I'm showing you guys how I'm gonna curl the whole thing and install it. FYI, I always pin my curls up before I let them down. Alright, so with this curl, I'm going to explain my method the best way I know how. Basically, pull out, twist down. Pull out, twist down. <laughs> Once you're at the end of the hair, you can go ahead and let the barrel sit for about 10 seconds before pulling it out. So this is what it looks like. Yes, ma'am. So I'm gonna go ahead and install it on my head and take the pin curls out now. So to begin, you already know, I have my stocking cap on and I'm gonna flatten my hair down.
Yeah, yo, yeah, yo. All right, see what that's looking like. Okay, scalp is a little lighter than normal, but I'm not mad. Shit, I mean, look, it's 2019. Who mad? <laughs> I'm happy, devil. Okay, wait. Mm, oh, mm, mm. man, I already know this is gonna be really cute. Let's go ahead and comb these curls out. Got to get rid of the flyaways. of a frontal immediately drops once it touches moisture or it gets wet so if you guys are trying to work out this summer or if you're going on a vacation i strongly suggest you get a closure as you can see closure shawty from now on period like don't know what y'all talking about <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this detailed layer and curling video you know sometimes it looks a little harder than what it really is i cut layers the same way each time and i curl the same way each time so really nothing to it just practice makes perfect if you're not already subscribed to my channel make sure you go ahead and do that and turn on your notifications just like that we are done and i can't believe i love this closure this much like i am officially converted back <laughs> thank you guys so much for tuning in make sure you subscribe to my channel if you're not already go ahead and do so and turn on your notifications Simon.
now we have going on the beauty masterminds is great it's better than i thought it would be i get to network with people but we're also getting questions answered so it's definitely a class you don't want to miss so you get way much more than you think you need The Beauty Masterminds networking event. It's a networking event about people that have businesses. It's tips, tips of the trade you're not going to find them anywhere else but here. We have Erica here, and tell us a little bit about your business. I have a cleaning business here in Atlanta. This event actually helps me a lot. I went to the last event, and she helped me on trying to be consistent trying to be more like showing before and after. I'm having so much fun today at the Beauty Mastermind with Breezy, okay? We've been talking just a lot about how to be a business owner even if you're not in the hair industry. I'm a lash tech myself and I've gained a lot of knowledge just about how to push through to keep going, stay motivated. I'm here at the Easy Breezy Women Empowerment and it is amazing and I'll definitely be back for the next event. Um, I'm here to network with people. I'm from Pittsburgh and I plan on moving to Atlanta. I just want to network with different people down here and get more and more advice to help everyone become successful. Okay, we're the red group. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Your... She said it here, so I can't. Oh, yeah. Your head. Your head. Yeah. Your tail. Yeah. Your tail. Yeah. Let's get it. Okay. Alright, so we got the red group. Every cosmetology test is made out of two parts of what I'll say. Period. Right. What color cancels out green? What color cancels out green? Yellow. What color does the product shimmer light cancel? Uh, brassy. The orange brassy. All right, you ready? Hold on. <laughs> you ready? <laughs> what color does the product shimmer lights cancel? Say, blonde. What is the product color oops used for? To correct the mistake. <laughs> what day do stylists normally take off? Sunday. What two payroll systems can a salon be based upon? POS. What does that mean? Um, commission or you can um, pay booth rent. What is a man's hair piece formally called? Okay. What inch hair did Nicki Minaj bring back in the style? 40, 50. Oh, which one? 40. The winner gotcha. of the Beauty Mastermind <laughs> is the winner. <laughs> breezy and we just wrapped up the very first beauty mastermind event if you didn't make it to this one make sure you catch us next time see y'all later